Yam and garden egg stew, a Ghanaian dish prepared by boiling 20 garden eggs and you will notice the change in color once the garden eggs are fully cooked and softened. The garden eggs I am using have not been peeled since they taste sweet, but often garden eggs are peeled once cooked as they can at times be bitter. The garden eggs are transferred into a blender with one mild green chili pepper, not to be smooth blend but to be mashed. Palm oil is what I am using with one medium sized onion. As the onion fries, small size salted fish is being added and fried along with the onions. The salted fish was pre-boiled to reduce the saltness before being used. The chopped tomatoes goes into the oil, fried a bit. adding one tablespoon of vegetable stock, leaving it to cook a bit as well. And then adding one tin of tuna in sunflower oil. Draining out the oil on the tuna before it's put into the stew. And the garden eggs are the last ingredients to go into the stew. Since I have been talking about garden eggs in my enzyme video and yam, the reason why today I have decided to cook you a garden egg stew or sauce as you can call it and yam together. So the sauce is ready. So now I'm going to prepare the yam. I'm going to peel it, then boil it. Then I'll show you all the finished food. Yam, if you don't peel it well, it tastes bitter. So when we peel it, we have to make sure that we do it very well. This is puna yam. Puna yam shouldn't take long to cook and also it should taste good.
yum it's all nicely cut didn't cut it too big it's a reasonable size is to cook very easily i'm going to wash it put it in the pan boil it then we'll come back to show you all oh, my Ghanaian stew or you can call it gravy and the yam to eat it with you can feel at home wherever you are in the world this yam has traveled a long way all the way from Ghana cooking the yam enough water to be poured and cover it place on the fire for the yam to boil until it becomes soft a bit of salt to give it a taste and then ready to serve to see more videos like this, comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. The notification bell is there to remind you of all future uploads. To so click on it to be one of the first to know when a new video becomes available. On this channel, I bring you lifestyle covering various subjects including cooking. Also, how to grow our natural hair healthy and long using DIY home remedies to make most of our hair products ourselves.